I've been getting a ton of comments of people asking how to improve their aim in Apex Legends Mobile. So I decided, hey, today is a good day. I can show you guys my routine on how I warm up and how I practice my aim every single day in Apex Legends Mobile. First things first, make sure you have good sensitivity settings that you guys are uh, super comfortable with. If not, go check out my HUD and settings video first and then come back to this video. Uh, but once you have your settings that you guys are super comfortable with and you wanna perfect, then what you're gonna wanna do, go ahead and click on the mode and change it to free practice, confirm and play. You're gonna go to free practice for 30 minutes. I know that's a long time, but, but there's all these weapons, every single weapon you could possibly think of. Go ahead and use the one you usually use the most in games, which for me is the R301. This is my favorite gun in the game. Come head over here you can get like stuff like a barrel stabilizer i usually pick one up and then um over here is your scope so what you want to do is you walk over to this little machine right here and then you want to click target practice by the way if you guys really want your aim to get really really good i do highly recommend you guys um purchase yourself a set of thumb sleeves mobile gaming thumb sleeves you can find a ton of different ones i use mgc's but it makes sure your screen surface stays super smooth and you're capable of being able to aim better so it makes your aim a lot more consistent anyways i'm gonna go ahead and start it off with easy mode boom you click start and it's going to spawn right here by the way i have not played yet today so you guys are seeing my exact warm-up um my aim is sometimes really trash when we log on in the morning all right so boom you're just gonna want to do this for about 55 seconds boom boom go back and forth and you want to get the highest score you possibly can Uh, boom, so that one is over. You're gonna wanna do that about three times, but to save you guys the boredom, I'm not gonna do that. Uh, so then you're gonna go from easy to medium and you're gonna go ahead and click start. Uh, sometimes I'll slide around and stuff like that and just use movement you typically use in a game. And uh, here we go, it's gonna start, boom. So now we got people that are running and you're obviously gonna wanna practice your tracking. Boom, that was medium. Then once you finish medium, you want to do that three times as well with easy. Then you're going to go ahead and switch it up to hard. Um, and then hard is basically kind of the same thing, but they go faster and they crouch at the same time as they go across. They don't just stand up. They they crouch up and down. See how that one crouched right there. Boom. But you just want to practice your you want to practice your tracking. I recommend moving side to side as you're aiming as well. That way you get used to like um, just moving side to side and not staying still. I, I spam my crouch button too. Um, so I'm crouching. You can jump up and down as you're shooting. You can slide, all that fun stuff. And uh, once you do this for a little while, you will feel super warmed up. You do easy three times, medium three times, hard three times. And then I re recommend you picking up the sniper and going through easy, medium, and hard one time each. And uh, all that will typically take you about 20 to 30 minutes. You can continue going if you don't feel like you're warmed up just yet. But boom, normally I do three times each. And then once you guys finish with that, I will go ahead, leave the firing range. I'll hop into a normal battle royale game, um, not ranked and just hop into a game just to play against a little bit easier players. You wanna land hot and just get as much uh, up close uh, fighting as humanly possible. If you feel your aim is absolute trash, I recommend don't even jump into games. Maybe spend a couple days just getting your sensitivity perfect and just tracking inside the firing range and just doing as much as you possibly can to uh, basically just get your aim better. The gun, nice, the R throw, I'm like, this is the gun I warmed up with, oh yeah. But see, jumping in a game is a completely different, uh, different feeling than the firing range. Definitely takes a lot more practice. That's why I recommend jumping in a game before before jumping into ranks. Just get your tracking really down. Ah, oh, I'm dead. But you guys see my warm up routine right there. I really wish I had more ammo. That's the main reason I died. But uh, anyways, hope you guys did enjoy. Hopefully this did help you guys with your uh, warm up routine.